Okay, so we just got a new package for the rally car. This just came in. This rally car, the neon. And uh, Adam found this deal on uh, Facebook Market? No, it was on a Subaru oh. page. Well, anyway, it was on Facebook Market. But uh, talked to the guys in Wisconsin. Uh, we've been looking for a pair of these for a long time. Set. Or, yeah, set. Yeah, sorry. Um, there's the box. Uh, we basically have been wanting to do this since the get-go, but uh, money didn't really um, allow us to. These bad boys up and uh, see what we got. Hopefully they're not total piles of trash, <laughs> but they are used. Um, but man, he was so nice to wrap these up. So nice. Hope he supposedly power washed them, so hopefully they they're clean. There's a re no, that's a front. That's front. That looks really small. <laughs> Does that not look really short? Hmm. It just doesn't have a giant spring. Yeah, on it. maybe. Anyway, they're teen. Uh, I think that's how you say it. They're adjustable compression and uh, dampening um, <clears throat> rebound, uh, adjustable camber on top. They are used, obviously. We're gonna send them in and get them rebuilt, or possibly try to rebuild them ourselves. That's the right height, I think, adjustment there. But anyway, pretty cool. Um, like I said, not brand new or nothing like that, but. The price was right, and uh, the neon will be uh, sitting on some coilovers now. So, so here's a rear. I'm guessing that one's got this one's the one that was. Yeah, it kind of looks like it. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go through these and and uh, make sure they're uh, good to go for a rally in uh, February. Um, it's kind of looking like it's gonna be either one of two things. Um, that one's broke. But, yeah, anyway. <laughs> well, you get what you pay for, right? <laughs> anyway. We can fix that. Um, they're not perfect, but we... Uh, it didn't pay anywhere near first price. Didn't pay a ton of money for them, so um, it was a pretty, pretty good deal. Probably the best deal I've seen on coilovers, so... And they're not completely like just they're not street coilovers either, so they're uh, they ought to do do what we need them to do. Uh, I think they have they have a ton of dampening uh, um, settings and and ride height, and so it'll be nice to kind of get the neon to where maybe it's not sitting as high, and you know maybe we can send it into the corners a little harder. <laughs> So, uh, talked to Gr Chris Greenhouse and he said that that's probably one of the best things we could do as far as a, an upgrade for the car. So, um, I hope that this is better. I don't think it, it's definitely not going to be worse because <laughs> the, the struts we were running were blown. Yeah. There they are right there. Um, we were in the super special stage at Potosi and it was like a pogo stick. So, okay, so Adam Smith is, uh, well... Never claimed to be. <laughs> so he's trying to take the top hat off of this spring or strip. <laughs> yeah, it was. <laughs> Gosh. Uh, you always see, hear horror stories about that stuff. But that was boring. <laughs> yeah, so we're gonna try these top hats on these uh, new coilers we got. I don't know if it's gonna work, but uh, if it does, that'd be great. <laughs> so, as you can see, the top hat does not. The spring fits and everything, but the uh, the hole goes around this shaft right here. The shaft <laughs> um, is uh, slightly 
too small. So um, we might just drill that top hat out. I'm not going to drill this out. So, you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. I've already got the drill bit. So, anyway. You might need to go out and get an actual drill bit. The right size. Yeah. <coughs> what size is that one? So, printing the next size up? Mm, bigger than that. So, we don't have the right size drill bit, and I want to do this somewhat right. So, <laughs> we are... Uh, going to uh, run to the store get a drill bit here's the stove guys um worked on that last night built that bad boy um you buy this kit i don't know if anybody cares or not but um, you buy this kit and uh, you buy a 55 gallon drum um i already had the flu pipe and <laughs> i think i got less than 60 bucks in this thing so we're gonna have heat out in the garage which is gonna be awesome I'm gonna continue spray foaming. As you can see, I got some up there. We gotta do the rest of the, the roof though, um, all the way around. Um, just that there is all I have left, but gotta get some more foam to get that all uh, closed up so it's a little warmer in here. This week, I wanted to work in the garage, but it was so cold that I didn't wanna work in the garage, so. Um, we're going to hopefully solve that problem and uh, people will want to maybe come out here and work even on their own stuff. So uh, the next thing is we're getting a lift. Just kidding. <laughs> LOL. No, I don't think we're tall enough. <laughs> maybe a little bit. We could, we yeah, could go up on the ground. Slide under yeah, we could probably get the cars up about nine foot or so. Eight foot. But Seven. Anyway, so we're going to go to the store and get some parts. We solved the issue with uh, the top hat. We had a kind of a funky setup in the rear. So um, the top hats that we had on the back uh, are now on these new the coilovers that we got. So um, it was fairly easy to do. Mm -hmm. uh, Adam did that today. Um, so... Um, the goal next is to um, get the control arms built and then um, rebuild these coilovers. Um, we just don't know what kind of abuse they had. Um, so we're going to try to redo them all. And then the next plan would be is to uh, go uh, test, test the suspension and try to dial it in a little bit. And, uh, yeah. 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 So, um, haven't mounted them up yet. Going to wait to rebuild them first. Um, we are ripping all the windows out. We kind of started, started on this one here and the other one over here is out. Um, we're going to do uh, Lexane windows or Plexi windows. Um, the back window we're going to do also. So that really I'm thinking, the door yeah, maybe the door windows too. Um, I'm thinking we're going to probably get at least, if we do the rear and the two sides, that's probably 50 pounds. You got to take into consideration the weight of the new windows and stuff, but, um, but yeah, we're also going to take, I don't know what, if any of you want to comment or anything, as much material out of the door uh, as we can. As you can see, it's pretty solid. I mean, all this and these doors are just, I mean, they're heavy, aren't they, Adam? Yeah. I mean, yeah. they're really heavy. And that's a big door, I mean. Um, so, I know that the rules state you're not supposed to, you can, but you're not supposed to do, take the instructional, structural integrity out of the door. So, we're going to do as much as we can without getting in trouble. But, uh, that's kind of what's going on. Get that window in the hole. Yeah. Mechanism out for that. That's yeah, so a the, lot of weight. the mechanism itself is pretty stinking heavy. So just little things uh, to try to make the car better and consistently uh, try to get faster every time we race. So I don't think we're going to get slower. But Unless it blows motor. Yeah. But uh, other than that, only other things we have to do before the next race is to get the exhaust fixed and um, 
you know, that kind of thing. So pretty easy stuff. Anyway, SRT out.